All right, so our uh, topic for uh, this morning is uh, making innovation sustainable and how to foster a culture of day-to-day uh, -day innovation. Now, my topic is some kind of uh, a conclusion or the one that stitches together all the topics that you've had since yesterday about innovation, about creativity, how to be innovative, how to be ingenious. Maybe later on there will be some questions about uh, what will, what's the difference between uh, ingenuity and creativity. Because I've encountered uh, that question before in the past, so I'm ready for that. <laughs> All right, so let's, uh, let's have our first. Now, there are two ways on how to be creative. There is a way for, uh, for you to be uh, unstructured by making use of unstructured uh, techniques. And there is also a way to make, uh, be creative in a very structured way. Now, my uh, discussion with you this, uh, this morning will be uh, on the structure side of being innovative. Uh, later on, maybe if you would like to expand more during our Q&A and ask me about what will be an unstructured way to be creative, I think I can share with you some of those tips. Now, there is a... Um, a terminology that was popular in Russia, and its term is called trees. Anybody here has encountered trees in the past? Yes, yeah, so there are some hands. So that's trees, you know. Our company's DigiLeaf soon will become DigiTree. <laughs> no, this uh, topic is really timely for me, although there's some kind of plugging. But soon will be a Digi Forest. So my topic is trees. So. Okay, now trees talks about to be creative in a very structured way. You can use uh, data in the past. You could also uh, use the, you can also use a methodology to be creative. So maybe some of you who's uh, been here for the first time and it's the first time for you to hear about trees, it alludes you to know how can be creative in a structured way, whereas being creative is more of the right brainer. Now let's have some trivia. If you're an analytical person, what part of your brain is working? Left, okay, left. What about if it's the right? Creative. What if it's not the left and the right? No brainer. Very good, Jeremy. You know? Are you in that uh, space or before you were in that space? <laughs> and now you're in the maybe a combination of the left and the right. 